on story it's everywhere okay this morning i woke up and markiplier had uploaded a video called taking a break i need a break um and i had to have a look um do a reaction video to it and see what it's all about um yeah this video has been filmed on the 24th is this ship date? Yeah, the 24th of September. But this video will only be uploaded on Friday. So it's like a week since he did this video. Um, I just wanted to leave a big gap. I wanted to react to it, but I wanted to leave a bit of a gap between Mark uploading it and me reacting to it because... Um, I didn't want it to seem like I was um, using this video for views. Um, I'm a big fan of Mark Players and I have so much respect for him. So whatever this video is about, I'll support him 100% and yeah, let's give it a look. Hi guys, I will cut right to the point. I am taking a hiatus for about a month. And the reason is I'm not very happy no. with the videos that I've been making. And that's not to say that I'm burnt out on making videos. I totally the opposite. I'm actually more eager than I ever have been to make videos. And, and that's kind of part of the problem. <laughs> I love making videos. So I, I, I'm more than happy to work nonstop on something that I'm proud of. I'm a workaholic. I, I'll work every day, bro. Uh, I, I don't take weekends. I don't take vacations. And I know this may sound strange to you guys because uh, like the schedule is super wonky so if I'm working non-stop then why are videos I so inconsistent? Totally I'm basically completely from. absent from social media um, and in a weird way it can seem like I'm doing nothing at all when in fact I'm trying to do more than ever at making the videos better or making me more satisfied with the videos that I'm doing but without I a way to exceed my own expectations and what I'm doing and what I'm posting and the videos that I'm making I don't feel like I'm ever improving the so then on and on it goes that I keep adding more and more effort into what I do and then it's this cyclical thing where I go oh it's not enough it or oh I need to work harder at this or, or, or I need to work better at this or improve this one thing and yet this kind of cycle has been going on for about a year now where, where I continually am unhappy with the videos that I make I try to solve the problem with brute force effort I know that feeling. rather than yeah creativity. I, in the end, I, I just don't want to settle on the videos that I'm really proud of and really excited for and really happy with and the videos that make me laugh that I make. I don't want those to be the exception to the rule. I want those to be the rule. Now, this doesn't mean that I'm going to be disappearing. A hiatus doesn't mean that I'm taking a vacation. I just told oh, you God. I don't do that. Uh, I'm actually going to be filming and planning and writing and collaborating every single day leading up to this. And uh, it also doesn't mean that I'm going to be completely vacant on content. Like, I'm probably going to be more like more active on social media than ever over the next few weeks just because <laughs> I will be goofing with you guys. I'll be talking with you guys. I will be trying to get feedback from you guys. I will be like in tune with the community again, which is something that I very much miss. And also there will still be content during this time, not a lot, but there will still be content. We have our charity live stream on the 30th of November so we're doing. Still uh, we still have the big project that is coming out and I will tell you a release date just to give you something okay. to look yeah, forward to. Uh, that is coming out Friday the 13th of October and it's gonna oh, be pretty cool. So you can look forward to that. Uh, and obviously we're still doing the on. tour. <laughs> Like the tour is definitely still happening and I can't wait to do that. I can't wait to be performing for you guys with I'm my friends. And, and, and even then, Thursday, we're going to be out there and we're going to be filming day. cool stuff um, while we're doing it. And I'm going to be talking with Bob and Wade and Tyler and Ethan. And I'm going to be talking with all those Matt guys Sarah. about like what videos can really like really make me passionate about it you know what what videos can i really burn for it what videos can i really like really strive to improve upon and, and what videos can i like surprise you guys because so, i know i can make really cool stuff it does so it's much just that, you know <laughs> my focus hasn't been able to be 100 percent dedicated like, like i'm an obsessive person i want to go to bed with a smile on my face week, knowing yeah. that you know, what I made it's on, is something it that people can remember, it, something that people will it cherish, so much. something that I'll cherish, and, you know. and that's, that's what's important. So anyway, to recap, 
I'm going on hiatus. I'll be back October 23rd is when I'm aiming to go back. That is the date set in stone. I'm marking the date. So you guys can count on seeing the new stuff starting to roll out on the 23rd of October. And uh, still doing the charity live stream, still doing the big project, still doing the tour. And it should be a lot of fun. So thank you guys so much for understanding. If you are upset about this, please record yourself screaming and panicking in the streets and post it all over social media as is the <laughs> usual multiplier <laughs> crisis response. So no, uh, thank no. you all so much for watching. I don't think anybody will and be upset. It may take a bit, I think people can but be I promise understanding about it. And I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. <laughs> I don't get the wink wonk thing. <laughs> okay, so basically, he's just having a break, which Markiplier he deserves. He does so many videos. It's like putting out. He puts out two videos a day. Um, same as Jack. Um, and. He just works 365 days a year, practically. Um, obviously, he I, he won't work on Christmas Day. I I don't think. Um, he but he has video coming up to like Christmas and holidays. He preps videos ready for that. So let's say two videos a day, seven days in a week. This is when my mass is gonna suck. So in roughly. He might be filming two, four, six, eight videos. No, two, four, six, eight. Yeah, two, four. <laughs> I told you my math sucks. Um, but it's be filming like two videos a week and um, two videos a day, and. Then on top of that, then he's got other things, he's, and he's so creative with his videos, like um, the Dickley Markiplier video he did, and the Darkiplier vs Antiseptic Eye, and a couple of the other, um, Markiplier TV, you know, he doesn't just do games, and, okay, 90% of his content is games, gaming, um, but he does do other things as well, and that's what gets me so annoyed when people say, oh, Markiplier and Jack said to Kai, they just sit around playing games, or, um, they're, they're not re it's not a real job, they're not really working, yes they are, um, because they have to find the games to do videos on, and then they have to edit it again like my math like, again my math sucks but Mark and Jack do two videos a, a day so seven days two four six eight they have to find eight videos and then they have to record eight videos it might might break it down into like we do for one day, for another, for another, and then for another, and then they'll look for videos next for the next week. But then we have to sit down and edit them. So I think that's why Mark has a team, uh, which is Catherine, and I think Tyler, and Jack as Robin, and I think Rishu uh, does a little bit of recording for uh, editing for him as well. I know she. He said that when he did the antiseptic guy thing uh, a couple of months back, she did a lot of the thumbnails and pictures and things like that. So, you know, they do have help, but it just really frustrates me um, that people just judge them because it's not a, um, what's the word, a um, mundane or not a... Um, a job that conforms to the norm you know but it's still a job they're getting paid to do this and even my mum the other day I was watching um, some of Jack's videos 
And even my mum said um, she would love to have a job like that where she can just play games. And my mum's not a gamer, um, but play games and get paid for playing the games. And she wasn't meaning it nastily. Um, she liked it because I said, said, well, that's what I'm trying to do as well. And she was like, oh, yeah, if it works, if you can do it. But the thing with the Mark as well is, and my, I really wanted to do a reaction video to this is because in from me, I don't do the same kind of videos as Mark. I know Mark probably, this will probably get lost in all the other fan videos and things like that, that for Mark. Is Mark was, and has been, and still is, an inspiration for me sitting down and trying to do a YouTube channel and I can't, I do get where it comes from with the creative thing you know like, I think that's what's been wrong with me the past few days I was just trying to find things to do and things to video and I just couldn't and it's frustrating because you want to try to improve and you want to try to progress but finding the right kind of things and finding stuff, it's hard. Um, and like I said, Mark has been an inspiration um, with, this, with me doing my YouTube channel along with Jack, along with Joseph, uh, Joseph? Joey Giuseppe. I'm still can't say his last name right, and Shane Dawson. Um, those four are the ones I just go, wow, you know, they, they're so cool, they're so, they seem so down to earth and so nice. I know when I met Joey last year, he was so sweet, um, he was very kind, and I said to him, like, he'd been an inspiration, and he was like, oh wow, thank you, you know, but Whatever's going on with Mark, and like I said, I'm sure he won't be away too long. 13th of October, I'm looking forward to that. Good feeling, 13th of October, Friday 13th, it's going to be something um, dark as player. So, that's something to look forward to. Um, so yeah, I, like I said, I'm open to get tickets for the Manchester leg of his tour because I got, I'm seeing Jack in a few weeks, so I've got to see Mark as well, come on, got to be done. Anyway, for now, I'll say thank you Mark for the inspiration, for being the person you are, for just being you and for being there for us and everything you do for us really. But for now, I'll say love you lots and lots like jelly tots and the keeping rigging weird. Bye.